Hi, welcome. Uh, you just had your first in-store session. Yes. Yeah. You announced that it was your first time. Yep. How did it go? I think it was a it was definitely a, a different kind of experience for us. Mm -hmm. um, we've never really played with acoustic guitars before or done an in-store or anything anything even close to this. So it was a different experience, but I think it went quite well. And everybody was just sitting there with their coffee listening. Uh, Everyone <laughs> was just they just happy to chill out, I think, and listen to some music and uh, have a bit of a clap at the end. Uh, and yeah, it was good. And then was it a kind of experiment musically as well with the acoustics you said? Yeah, but <laughs> definitely. Yeah, we were learning the songs about five minutes before we played. Which <laughs> was, like, how can we translate these from our from our big electronic set into into like one or two acoustic guitars? <laughs> so it was a, it was an experimentation thing. Yeah, because your music is very danceable and very uh, upbeat. And, and yeah, well, yeah. there's so much so much energy in the live set. There's um, everyone plays drums and everyone's always playing percussion and the guitars are big and loud and the electronics are in your face and it's uh, it's yeah it's quite quite a big full sound. To, it's difficult to strip it right back, but but I think it's fun and I, I loved doing it. It was a it was a good a good challenge. And I saw you shuffling the, the guitars around, uh, playing different people playing different instruments with yeah. the songs. Yeah. Do you do you all play a lot of instruments or? Yeah, we do. Yeah, most yeah. everyone can play guitar except for our drummer. Our drummer is just purely just he's like the best drummer you'll ever meet, but he's just drums. But he's got a great voice actually, though. He's okay. a really really good singer. But he Central. didn't sing with you now, but does he sing? Uh, uh, yeah, he sing, he yeah, sings he's in our large. in our set. Yeah. All the time. And what is your favorite instrument to, to play or to? Oh. Funnily enough, I think my favorite instrument is drums. Oh, mine's bass. <laughs> I love the drums. You just. Oh, actually, I like keys. Beat the shit out of it <laughs> for like. Why a, don't you play the drums then? And ah, uh, uh, I don't know. Is it because you're the front? Riley is a better drummer than I will ever be by by a million times, and and I and I can sing, so I guess it makes more sense. <laughs> and yours is the bass? Yeah, uh, all, all keyboards. I like keyboards. They good fun. Okay. Um, let's see. You're working on your full, full album now. Mm. Yeah. How far along are you? Because you have mm. a few songs now with the EP. Yeah. Almost yeah. halfway. Yeah, probably about halfway. Yeah. Yeah. And is it is it all the the same happy uh, upbeat sound or no. is it? No, no. We're trying There's to some different flavors on this one. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, we're trying. We're going to try and explore some different. Regions that we haven't um, haven't delved into yet. Like we might try some softer stuff, maybe mm. some uh, some violins and a bit yeah. more emotion in the music. Something with a bit more depth, mm -hmm. but um, still keeping with our with our energetic, big full sound and trying to keep it trying to keep it as catchy as possible. Yeah. C can you give an example of what it what it would, what it sounds oh. like? With, with okay. Uh, Alt J, Frank Ocean, maybe a bit of the New Strokes album. Uh, who else could we throw in there? Metronomy. Oh, yeah, it's, I don't know. It's a lot more synth driven, a lot more. Kanye West. Yeah, a lot more beat and a lot, a little bit slower than the EP stuff that you'd be used to, but better melodically with vocal. And, and did you and did you choose to, to put this side also in uh, to be more diverse or, or was um, it just a natural way of Yeah, of I guess it's a bit of design? a natural progression and we mm. still got a lot of the pop stuff from what we're doing now but we're sort of doing an album that opens us up for album number two as well mm -hmm. so that we can sort of change directions quite easily and it being expected, not being a shock to people. I mean, there's going to be a lot of different flavors on the album. I think it'll be a bit of a journey. It won't just be you skip through to the song that you like. It'll just be more like you want to hear every song in succession. Hopefully, mm. if we can do it properly, and it's, it will be. And like it sounds that. like you're, you're experimenting mostly for your own development in this. Yeah, well, we do. We write songs we enjoy. If we don't like it, then we don't do it. You know? We want it to be quite a, a creative, experimental sounding album. In like instead of just like a pop rock album. Yeah. Um, we want to yeah we want to sort of delve into just going off on tangents. I mean even if we just go on, like on instrumental tangents for a couple of minutes, we're we're not. 
uh, we're not scared of that, or we're not yeah. just going to keep it into three-minute pop songs. But it's 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 uh, pretty daring to experiment on your first uh, full album. Yeah, but I think because that's Because you could us. also go for uh, just do what works and, and yeah. keep uh, stick to always, that. It's been our way. I think that's kind of what makes the Griswolds who we are. We we haven't really done anything that wasn't, oh, the book. wasn't a little bit oh. scary or a little bit out of the ordinary. Like the film clip we did was a, was crazy. And the first EP we did, we produced it by ourselves because we knew what we wanted and we wanted to go in a direction that was a bit left of centre. Okay, the, uh, about the film clip, it looks like loads of fun, <laughs> that was fun. to film that. Yeah. That's great. <laughs> With all the colours and, and making a big mess. Yeah. yeah it was, was, it, was it like a, a day uh, doing? Yeah, just this, one, day. One, one day. One day to film, five days to clean. <laughs> yeah. New furniture, new everything. Terrible clean-up. Oh, it was horrible. <laughs> we didn't expect it to get so out of control, but too much alcohol. Was it worth it? Yeah, absolutely. It yeah, was the best, we'll it was the best it day of my life to this day. We would Still, do it again, like with no hesitation. Yeah, I've really. never had so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> and you try to be, uh, try to keep to yourself, also with the outfits and, and how you present yourself to the uh, audience. <laughs> we just try, we try to keep it lively. Yeah. We try to keep it colourful and uh, wear what you feel like it. wearing. Yeah. <laughs> do you have one line in, in what you what you wear like this, or or do you change it a lot? I think we change it a lot. Like, yeah. I just think every gig's different, and. Uh, <laughs> it's no uniform. Yeah, every gig's different. We always wear something different at every single gig, and yeah, we don't really think about it too hard. We just kind of put on whatever's there. Whatever is okay. If yeah. it happens to be a, a really colourful pair of tights, then that's how it is. <laughs>